Reed Synod is more than a simple camp body that we have seen the Miami Dolphins add before at the position but there isn't much value there. When the Miami Dolphins take the field in September, Reed Sinnott will be on the Dolphins practice squad or he won't be on the team at all. Where he won't be is on the sideline and I would venture to bet that even if an injury happens to either Tua Tungavailoa or Jacoby Brissett, the Dolphins will bring someone else onto the roster. In August of 2020, Sinnott's NFL career began when he signed an undrafted rookie deal with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers that included $152,000 guaranteed at signing. He wouldn't make the roster but would get added to the team's practice squad. The San Diego product would, in an entirely, can't make this up, twist would become a Miami Dolphins quarterback thanks to Josh Rosen. Rosen was released by the Dolphins during the final cuts for Miami in 2020. He would sign to the Bucks practice squad and the Bucks released Sinnott to give Rosen the spot. Rosen would sign with Miami six days later on September 14. On two occasions last year, Sinnott would find himself on the active roster. Once in November and once in January. In week 12 he was active against the Jets and in week 17, the Bills. Sinnott was demoted back to the PS after each game and now, he will compete for the right to stay there. The problem is that Sinnott isn't a player that is really showing he has the tools to be a competent backup and I still stand by my notion that before camp begins later this month, the Dolphins will add a fourth QB to the roster if for no other reason than for reps in practice. Jacoby Brissett will serve well enough this year and he could become a longer-term solution to the Dolphins' backup position after this year. He is on a one-year deal but no teams were knocking his door down trying to get him to sign a deal that would allow him to compete for a starting job. Brissett has only been in the league for five seasons and has a lot of football years ahead of him but he is a backup at this point in his career and that makes players like Sinnott, expendable. The Dolphins will have to evaluate Brissett after this season but it would be surprising to see Sinnott take a major step towards replacing him after this season, it's not impossible but he still has a long way to go before the Dolphins can have confidence in him coming off the bench.